Are you frustrated by the diver error popping up while updating your favorite Call of Duty games like Warzone and Modern Warfare 2? No worries at all. I've got you covered. In this guide, I'll walk you through the steps to fix the diver error in Call of Duty Warzone and Modern Warfare 2. Let's dive right in. Solution 1. Reset your network configuration settings. First, locate the search icon and type CMD. Next, right click on command prompt, then select run as administrator and click yes. Now, type netsh when soft reset and hit enter. After that, type ipconfig slash flush dns and hit enter. Then type ipconfig slash release and hit enter again. Followed up by typing ipconfig slash renew and press enter. Now, type netsh int ip reset and hit enter. Don't worry. I'll include these commands in the video description below. Finally, reboot your computer and check if the error persists. Solution 2. Change your DNS to an optimized one. Begin, open command prompt. If you can't find it, simply type cmd in the search bar. Click to open it. Now type ping 1.1.1.1 and press enter to get the ping details. Similarly, type ping 8.8.8.8 and press enter. Once you've identified the DNS with the lowest ping, go to settings, then click on network and internet. Click on ethernet. Next, click on the edit button next to DNS server assignment. Select manual. Ensure IPv4 is turned on. In the preferred DNS box, add the DNS server with the lowest ping. Move on to alternate DNS. For 1.1.1.1 DNS server, type 1.0.0.1. For 8.8.8.8, type 8.8.4.4. Lastly, click Save. Then check if the error is resolved. Solution 3. Repair the game. Open the Call of Duty Launcher. Then click on the Settings icon. Now select Scan and Repair. After that, click on Begin Scan. The launcher will check for any corrupted or missing files and prompt you to update them. After that, you should be able to play the game without encountering the error. That's it. You've successfully troubleshooted the diver error in Warzone, Modern Warfare 2 and other Call of Duty games. If you found this guide helpful, please consider hitting the like button. And if you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below. And I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thanks a bunch for watching.